your questions and concerns. And we are lucky enough to have Dr. Daria Long. She is with me now to answer some of your questions. And just so touching, humanity at its best, as the governor of New York was saying. Dr. Daria, you work in the ER, you see it, you are on the front lines. Is there enough now? Are there more masks needed to protect those like you fighting this virus? Good morning, Susan. I love that it, it is humanity at, is, at its best, and we see stories like that. And I, when it comes to masks right now, I would say this is very region-specific. Some have enough, some don't. In, in my own hospital, we have enough right now, in large part because in many ways, we as physicians have gone out and sought our own or because of donations like Governor Como, I have had many people reach out to me and given me their only two masks that they happen to have from, from some other hobby that mm -hmm. they had. So we have mm -hmm. enough, but enough means one mask for every mm -hmm. two shifts. My mask tore the other day, Friday night in the middle of a shift, and we had to kind of, we tried to jerry-rig it back together with a, a tourniquet. So I'm, I do worry if we were yeah. to have another surge, if we'd have enough. And I want to get to these questions here. It shows that you are all working together trying to get that mask back on you as you're working hard to save lives. This is from Hillary on Facebook, Dr. Daria. I'm at home with my boyfriend who has coronavirus. I have severe asthma, she says, and get pneumonia almost every year. What can I do to protect myself and take care of her boyfriend? So Hillary is the kind of person I would consider her in the vulnerable population. I would say she is one, Hillary is one that we would want to keep kind of a firewall around her, making sure she doesn't get sick, not having her go out into society and doing all, you know, going to the store and doing things like that. Stay home, stay well. Really important that we protect people like Hillary who are our most vulnerable. And I know you're going to join us uh, later this morning to answer more questions. Keep them coming in. You can reach Dr. Daria or myself on social media, Twitter and Instagram. Thanks, Dr. Daria. Thanks, Susan.